My name's Shane Claiborne, and I am a, a Southern guy born down in East Tennessee. I fell in love with Jesus in the heart of the Bible Belt. I ended up reading my Bible and starting to ask, what if Jesus meant the stuff he said? And I helped uh, organize a movement of Christians called Red Letter Christians. And we kind of decided we're gonna stop complaining about the Christianity that we've experienced and work on becoming the church that we dream of. It's that. This is one of the plows that we made actually out of an AR-15. This metal used to be an assault rifle that we melted down, heated up and beat it into a plow and now we're able to use it in our garden. And I, I look at that and it's this beautiful transformation from death to life. And I, I think it's a beautiful metaphor of what God's doing in the world. One of the things I love about that old passage in Mike and Isaiah, beating swords into plows, is, is that it doesn't begin with politicians. Sometimes when I throw my hands up at God and I say, you know, God, why don't you do something about gun violence? I say, I can kind of hear God say back, I did do something, I made you. I absolutely think Christians have the power uh, to change things. We, I mean, we just look at the damage we've done. <laughs> if we can do that much bad, I think we can do a whole lot of good. So, and I look at history from the civil rights movement to the abolition of slavery movement, the movement for women's rights, the Christians were in the forefront of so many of these things. I wanna be a part of singing a better song. I wanna be a part of a Christianity that doesn't just see our faith as a ticket into heaven and a license to ignore the world we live in, but my faith actually compels me to care about justice in this world, to care about people now and to care about policies that affect them.